Well, guys, today we're going to do some unboxing today. Let's see. Here you go, you see it's a Metal Gundam Diamate. Been a while ago, at least 10 years after Gundam Xia. Even you will see the Bandai logo already changed to blue as well. And there is like a Tamashi online order. Let's uh, unbox it and see how it goes. Okay, let's see what do they have. You see right here is all the accessory with the iconic shield for him. And uh, second layout is the face. And they're using like different color tone for the test. If I remember right, the XCA was using the blue. Also the instruction menu. Oh, because uh, this one, they find a new backpack. There's uh, one of the gimmick. And then as you can see right here, that backpack could be used for any others. Window as well, and um, you will see the cup weapons if you have it. You can attach on it, but of course you have used the additional pin to attach on it. So that's uh, everything for the instruction menu. Like so. So for that one, like uh, only the backpack will like uh, could be used for any others. And uh, so, as far as you see right here on this section, this come from other metal build and um, for that. So far, that one doesn't have much um, accessory. The most is like they got heaps of the pin. To work on it. Maybe we just get the main figure of the look. That's why I talk about this are all the pin. You can slot and swap to put it on it. Okay, let's close a look to see the figure. There you go. Wow, this time they just used the chest section to cover the protecting plastic as well. And let's take it out have a look. Let's have to look for the DN drive. If I really can see the test right there. Anyway, I just like um, to look back. And that the iconic for the Gundam should be on top. So, and there's the head, and also tiny, tiny, like the shoulder, which is this section exactly like um, Xia. I'm not sure the actual color as in the camera will slightly different or not. Because of this time that one we used the matte finishing for the whole thing. And somehow this hand is up in use. And not strong like as the hand. They got some gimmick for the armor and the mover DSD. So which is the whole figure like uh, matte finish. And then um you'll see the first season or the Gundam they come with that purple. And this purple, like, they did some pure, pearl in the pearl of it. Clear. It's not actually clear, just like you will see. It's like um, quite shiny. Maybe they did the special clear coat on it. 
And it makes clothes look for the fit as well. You can bend the fit like this as well. A long time ago, finally, they got the second Gundam of the Gundam Double First Season. What about the give you see a second character from the storyline. And compared with any other metal build, somehow the hand looks so tiny of the others. Alright, let's put that aside and go ahead for the accessory pack. Alright, let's go for the accessory pack. You will see right here. They help you with the color they finish for this one. You see the paint, they got like additional paint on it. For compressing the box art, you can't really see the difference. The box art just like it's like a normal red or whatever. And uh, you'll see all the spare hand right here. And also they got the another gimmick for this part. That could be same as the Master Grey. I think but they're not surprised me before like when they launched the other metal view already have the same technique on it also you see the weapons right here like so I still remember why I built the first one 100 Gundam model kit with our master grey they are the whole piece you will need to color it or I need to place pretty much a masking tape on it as you can see right here at the end of the they got some paint job that's it so that one is not much special pretty much all the metal build they did the same effect as well let's go ahead for the main wrap for Put the iconic sniper. So for that one, not much thing to play with, and uh, pretty much similar to the one the what's it called metal build, like X or something. I forgot. So the sniper pretty similar, except the section at the front are different. So they come with the same thing for like uh, the that the slider standing like so. Make the iconic pose, which is like uh, for slider like so. Let's go ahead with the DN drive. Of course, you can like uh, remove it because uh, why did they remove it? It's because um, they got to fully attach the new design backpack on it, and I'm pretty sure that the end drive right here, that one, like the battery pack or something, is removable. So. Which is like all the um food, food is attached to drive and then you can remove it. I wonder if you want you can attach on it as well. Let's try. Yeah, it is. You can fully attach on it if you want. Instead of the using this one. 
and uh, I've looked at additional arm. That's how they hiding it. It's like a very simple design. That's how they bend it. Of course, you can pose it as well. Flip it the other way around to hold the weapons. But pretty sure that one is exactly as the one before. The one has been launched, the uh, XCR, that one. Yeah, you could bend it the other way around as well. You will see it turned to be a two additional arm. And let's go ahead to see if they attach on it. So you have to put all these sections, the arm who lock on it, and then flip up, and then uh, I'll just lock in. That would be like a lock in case. So up to this step, you can like uh, fully install on the weapon. Cool. Next, we go up to the shield, the tiny one, as you can see the logos. And that one made me remember like the, the Shrek Gundam, the one for the launcher, that one. They come with the senior shield, but that one, they didn't, they didn't do the metallic paint. And um, also the instruction manual to talk about this pin, you can like um, remove it. If you slot the other pin, somehow you can slot the handgun in there as well. If you lock in case, that's so. After that, we go to have to lock this one. And um, I haven't built the master grade for this one, so I'm not sure the design is pretty similar or not because um, the additional. They can extend it and they will be easy to flip around the angle. And also that one you can extend it as well. Like so after you extend that one so you can like uh, flip around it. Be happy with the design how they did. Uh, of course, that's the one before the shield, you can swap that up into the hand in there. Um, and pretty much that one is similar as the cost for zero. Maybe we will do some reviews for that one later. And one more thing we talk about is the slot for which is on the leg part right there and how did they hide the uh, weapons in there just like that the right yeah because this time they come with the additional backpack so we do have the additional another two on it. Four in all. Alright, nearly forgot the last section for this. Of course, they got some um, gimmick on it as well. You can, like, um, flip it open too. Before, I wasn't happy like the design. Just like looked like a butterfly. All right, today is up to here. Of course not. Yo, so finally I got this one. The Gundam Vic Figuration. Gundam Vic Saku. And the special edition with the pilot. Don Saku. But um, by the way, I still haven't watched that um, 
of VA version of this Gundam yet. But um, in hand, that one is much heavier than the metal we just then. Alright, let's unbox how to look. Okay, what we got right now, the instruction as you show. Let's see. I don't have the actual green sakura before, but I do have the char that one. Um, probably maybe we do a refill later. And for that one, the accessory is much more. And then you will see the redesign of the armor, which is repair or battle damage. And also this figure, the better than any other Gundam facts is. It is some weathering of the figure itself. Okay, the put the side have to look. Might be go ahead with the weapons. Nah, just have to look the base first. And you will see for the mono eyes, you got like uh, additional small and a big one. And they got the uh, and the other spare hands of different poles. And with all the accessory, the weapon pack, you will see they got like a 1, 2, 3, 4, Bakusa, or Walk Launcher, or whatever. And they got the additional thing you can modify for a different one. And all because without build up the slot, all of them might be single use only. And you will see those is for the longest one, and the others for the other size. Now, with the additional arm you can attach on the backpack to attach on the shoulder. And you will see the main ass is like um, the one that been right up. Yeah, you will see the distance, a difference. It's right there for the compressing that one. You will see the link standby mode, like the other one on in hand to use it. Let's closer look for this main weapon. For him, all the Saku standard weapon. Uh, they got a cover on it. Pretty much all the Gundam fix for the. Zero, zero, 0079, that series, all of them, they do have the cover on that one. Like so, when you flip it, just flip it around, it's not bladdered. But uh, I'm not sure this is a new design or not. And um, they could, they did the matte finishing except this handle right here. Maybe I expect you just like using the holding it. And next, compressing the longest one and the shortest one. So all of them should have the additional angle with it. And maybe swap one of them at the low. So just like uh, we move that one. Like so. And probably we will slot get rid of that. To attach the other one on it. Go. And then you can slide it in so that way it's done. Next will be the longest one right here. Okay, and the longest one they might be used a different one. You will see somehow the paint, the grey, might be under the camera is different. Uh, they got different color tone on it. Alright, so those two rocket launcher or bazooka are done.
Okay, let's see for the main figure right now. Oh, wrong way. As usual, not much different. As long as um, they still using a form. But uh, I'm not sure for the future, like, it doesn't provide any form. But I want this big plastic for the Chikokin. Let's take it out of the look. In hand, definitely feel the die cast. I have no idea that one to cooking. Like the non fix. They're using these more die cast than the actual metal wheel just then. Maybe the design are uh, different. Because the circle is more old you see. That's why they should have the weight on it. And this design, they got a new design for all the armor, like the like damage. It's very cool. And uh, all the angle pivot, they did it very well. And you can't believe that how bulky robot could be put much like post. And then um, for the skirt that one you can additional move it and then you can bend more right here and um, take it up there and you will see the joint the leg for the hip you can put very cool poles on it as well like so I'm not sure the master grey kit right now they can do it or not. But uh, this is a later design for the hip joint. How they could pose the figure properly. It's good. <clears throat> and um, that's why I said before they did the weathering on it. Oh my god. It's okay with the actual die cast. Fat on it. Yeah, that one is definitely recommended instead of the actual when you put the green one. But uh, I saw some video compressing. Of course, the design are different. Even this part, the shoulder part, that one is slightly smaller. The head has been redesigned. You can open it and put the angle of the eye as well. You will see the iconic shield for the pilot and the battle damage. Also, yay! That section you can flip it as well. It will show up because from the beginning I have really confused about the. Long time ago, the high grey 144 kit. And why right now I find out actually the design was like that. They just hide in there. Oh my god. How creative for those people to design the actual. Not cool for that. And one more thing, which is the angle pivot for the arm for this one. Even for in January, they could fit the arm like this, right? But they additionally make another angle for that, which is very cool. You can bend the arm like this. Oh my god. I never think about they can do the angle like this. You see the arm, the elbow right here. Because in general, all the Gundam, you have to bend like this. Right. You will see the big difference on the left and right. On the left hand is much cool. I can't believe it. So nice that one. By the way, for talk about the price, those is like a uh, might be for the Kamashi only. Every single time from overseas to purchase it, you have to pay additional extra on it. Otherwise, you never get the like uh, actual price on it. And why now they fully block all the 
people who are not in the local to purchase it every single time you purchase you have to wait somehow have to wait till they got a good deal for that but uh, as well I got the metal bill just then of course I need to pay extra on it you have no idea when would they put the high should be high or what they might the price should be dropped but like one to two years later or more common it depends for the market but I'm not really sure about it anyway today definitely unboxing is up to here thanks for watching see ya